Good morning. It rained. Actually, it rained about 15 minutes ago. <laughs> um, we have gotten, it's in about a week, week and a half ago, well, about a week ago, we got roughly around seven and a half inches of rain. Well, take that back. We got between five and a half and seven and a half inches of rain between here and green up, depending on where you were. We had close to seven and a half inches down by green up. We had around five to five and a half inches here in Charleston. So grass is starting to grow again. It has greened up. Um, I've got to go to finish a job uh, that we started with that landscaping job. We've got to bury a electric line for uh, the ladies outdoor lighting. So and it just rained. So what am I doing? I'm heading to McDonald's to get me some breakfast. guys I hope you're enjoying this video so just wanted to kind of jump in here real quick and do a quick little overlay so things have been busy we have been mowing like crazy we like said we've got rain probably not as much rain as St. Louis did at 12, at 12 inches these videos were recorded uh, a few weeks ago uh, the one you're watching now was actually recorded uh, on July 30th uh, which is 
time of recording here, but uh, when you see this, it'll probably be July 31st, or maybe even August. Who knows what time I get this out, but I've been super, super busy. Uh, I did hire a new guy on. His name is Gatlin, and this was his first day helping me today. You may see him in uh, the background there, my one with the 60-inch. Uh, I am on the 72, which we are uh, going to be doing some work to soon. Um, hydraulic hydrostatic pump that has been on there since the unit was built uh, has a small leak uh, it just started leaking um, on this day uh, July 30th it was, it's a very very small leak nothing major the leak is coming out of where the um, control uh, arm is I think there's a seal in there it should be able to pop out and pop a new one in I used to work at Hydro Gear in Sullivan, Illinois, so I have been around those kind of pieces and kind of know the ins and outs of what uh, the pumps and hydro pumps and all that have in them. I was actually the one making the wheel motors and stuff like that, running up as a test station to make sure they worked. My girlfriend actually worked over in the pump section, was making the 5400s and I believe the 4500 pumps. I believe these have the 5500 pumps on them, which is the commercial grade pump. Uh, this mower does have 1,663 hours on it, believe it or not, and um, it's done pretty good. We did put a new motor on it two and a half years ago uh, when it belonged to GoMo. Um, the motor had something go wrong with it, and uh, no, it wasn't under warranty, but we got it replaced, and uh, boy, I hate picking up sticks. But uh, it's a lot better than running these over. This is a cottonwood tree here that I'm mowing under. As you can see, it's already losing its leaves. Uh, actually, the past month, uh, roughly, roughly the last month or three weeks or so, it's really been losing its leaves. Uh, this tree does this every single year. I kind of wish they would cut it down. I hate cottonwood trees. This whole yard in the spring looks like there's snow on top of it with the uh, cotton that falls out of it. But anyway, so we're going to be uh, taking a look at that pump uh, probably here soon, probably next week. And we've also got something happening to the 60 inch uh, Hustler Z. Uh, we've got some new stuff coming for it. So we're going to be updating it and making it a better, better mower. We're upgrading some things, we're adding some new things, we're doing some things different. Uh, we also got a new blade sharpener uh, to sharpen blades, so uh, stay tuned for that video. Uh, that video will be on this channel and on the uh, product review channel that I do, so if you haven't done so, go check those out. And um, we're going to continue mowing here, but uh, haven't really had a lot going on other than mowing. We did put some bids in on some uh, landscaping jobs that just haven't came about yet. So hopefully those will come in and we will get those going. We've got some other work to do. I've got some power washing coming up, some tree, a little small tree I've got to cut down instead. A uh, tree I've got to trim and uh, working on equipment. So there are going to be some more videos with that. I cannot wait to show you what we've got for the, uh, basically the mower that you see sitting in front of me. I have the camera, the GoPro Hero 9 clamped to the handlebar on the Hustler Super Z, which is the 72 inch mower we have. And, yeah, looks, looks really good uh, quality there. But we're going to head and get some water, uh, or uh, in this case body armor, because it's always good to stay hydrated while you're working. So you can enjoy the ride as we head to Casey's gas station and get some H2O and body armor.
right, looks like we got our uh, H2O and our uh, nice drink there to keep us cool. Now we've got just a few other lawns that we're doing on this day and uh, we want to go get those taken care of so we can call it a day. So we are headed to a local car wash here in town, or well, one of the local, probably one of the best car washes that we have here called Dirt Busters and we do take care of that. Of course I didn't film any uh, video there. Uh, it was kind of one of them deals that was crunch time. It was getting kind of later in the day and we had three other lawns, uh, well two other lawns after the uh, car wash to do. So we were wanting to get done and I was super tired. We've both been working uh, long days uh, and we were tired. Luckily the weather wasn't super hot out or anything like it's going to be next week. They're talking 115 to maybe even 125 degrees here next week uh, with actual air temperature over 100. So it's going to get super hot. We've got some really awesome videos and then the next video will be kind of an exploration, I guess, of things we're doing to the equipment and I want to kind of update you on some things that's happening uh, elsewise on the channel. So stay tuned. Again, thanks for watching. I know it's just been kind of been a kind of a rambling on kind of video, but sometimes that doesn't hurt to have one of them videos. But anyway, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, tell your friends about the channel. Uh, you know, if you guys want to see any certain thing with any of the equipment or any type of video you want to see, drop those in the comments. I'd love to help you out. Have a good one, guys. See you in the next one.